again for inviting us into your homes. First, I want to make a slight commentary. You know, New York and Titan Sports and WrestleMania and everything that's been going on, they've been making a lot of allegations. They attribute, Vince McMahon has self-attributed the fact that he has caused a new renaissance or rising in wrestling. I want to tell you something. Wrestling's been on a roll since 1970, and everybody in Mid-South knows it because they've made it happen here, and we really appreciate that. He's taken a lot of credit for things that don't happen, but I want to say one thing also. There's athletics and there's showbiz. You know, Muhammad Ali was a great fighter. He was a crowd pleaser. He was so great that he could show off and still knock you out or whip you. A lot of great wrestlers are like that. That's what makes pro wrestling exciting. But when you take an actor and make him an instant wrestler, that's baloney. And I want to say another thing. Even mean Gene Okerlund has been in the ring in a main event in Minneapolis. I think when ring announcers can get in the ring, that's baloney too. That's why we'll never feature that in Mid-South. We have athletes in Mid-South that are two-time All-Americans like our first bout here, Edgar Thomas. They start just like everybody else from the bottom up. We play no favorites. And when you're talking about showbiz and stars hanging around, I was talking to Dusty Rhodes on the phone the other day, and Dusty said, you know, Bill, remember when we were walking tall in Georgia, how the people hung around? And I can remember back in the middle 70s and right on up to now, Dusty Rhodes, when he was in New York, was with Bette Midler, John Belushi on stage when John was alive. He goes all the time to Willie Nelson concerts, Boxcar Willie. I know Jerry Clower has come right here on Mid-South. Jerry Lee Lewis used to go to the matches in Atlanta. A good friend of mine, Jeff McKay, who stars on Magnum P.I., He's a, he comes around a lot. The Gap Band, who live in Tulsa, come to the matches in Tulsa. ZZ Top and Dusty Hill are big fans in Houston. So I want to say one thing. Stars have been around wrestling for years because they wanted to be and the wrestlers wanted to be. It wasn't where somebody paid them to hang around. So I want to say one thing. We're going to stay right with what makes wrestling solid and a sport. Mid-South Wrestling, let's go to the ring for the first exciting bout.